Hello my perfume lovers, addicts, fanáticas de perfume como yo. Welcome back to another video and this is my top 10 updated top 10 for life. Okay, so I had put a poll on my um, community tab asking if I should do an updated top 10 or an old school throwback and so I decided, well I'm not decided yet on which one I'm gonna post first but I'm recording them today and um so yeah, this is always a very tough video. I know I always say the same thing. It's to any top 10 is tough for me because I have like 300 fragrances and I love almost all of them. Um, so it's really hard to choose. And this one, I'm going to tell you which one was battling for that last place because it was very hard because I said, oh, I'm going to do a top 10 for life. But then I was like, what am I getting myself into? Like, why did I ask them? You know, now I got to like, Pick 10 and it's hard. So anyways, so let's just go ahead and get started with the first one. Okay, so the first one that I'm going to tell you about is Angel Share Killian Angel Share. There we go. So the beautiful whiskey type bottle is so beautiful and it has all of the cinnamon, the cognac, the oak, the praline. It's just so good. So I feel like so many fragrances have been inspired by this um, Angel Share. We have Cout at Nights, Ojan, um, what's the other one? Herod, all these like cinnamon based and they're all so nice. And they're all so nice. Um, oh, also um, Amber, Invite Only Amber by Kayali. There's all of these very yummy cinnamon. They have a lot of cinnamon and that I just love it so i have to give it to the first one for me that i uh experienced so that's that one and of course remember brooklyn fragrance lover from alexandria fragrances if you want a great do for this to not pay what this cost okay so the next one speaking of alexandria fragrances they're my favorite dupe house and this is honey which is the imitation for Ani by Nishane, I shall put the picture. So look at that. I mean, it's such a beautiful, spicy vanilla. Yeah, I, I said I wasn't going to spray, but I'm going to spray just one. It's beautiful. I love it. I love it. And this is a beast mode. It lasts a really long time. So you don't have to worry about retouching. As long as you spray yourself real good, you are good for eight hours at least eight hours okay so that's that one maybe in the future i'll purchase the original but why if this i had a little sample and i compared it to this and it was the same so that's that the next one i'm going to tell you is shagaf Oud by swiss arabian my golden brick okay my golden brick this is an oud and rose combo with praline it's sweet it's yummy it's luxurious i love it and of course this is beast mode be you if you're gonna wear this you have to commit you have to commit and you have to know that this is going oh my god excuse me i my eyelashes the struggle right of eyelashes okay you have to commit to this one because it will be on you for a very long time eight to twelve hours so um if you don't like, or if, you know, I would just start out with a few sprays. Don't go crazy. Don't overspray. This is one that you don't overspray unless you want to bother somebody and you want people to be hating on you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Am I? So that's that. Oh, also, I forgot to mention, this is really, 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 really almost identical to Oud Bouquet by Lancome. So if you like Oud Bouquet and you have a sample, save yourself some money. Get this. Okay next one i have is another alexandria fragrances this is vanille dory if it wants to focus and this is the imitation for spiritus double veni uh a beautiful um i would consider a niche very expensive this is a smoky sexy vanilla this is something that uh you know better for the cold and when you want to feel sexy and something you know like of a special occasion wow this is beautiful this is a very good imitation 
and it's really strong it's getting in my nose so this one is that smoky vanilla it's so good here it says vanilla balsamic warm spicy i love my spicy vanillas and spices period okay the next one that i have is this is just a bottle just a regular bottle that i bought on amazon because i bought it in a refillable bottle this is alien essence absolute this is the original bottle this is for me a masterpiece and it will be in my top 10 for life forever it has the alien dna the original alien but it has vanilla myrrh incense and has this menthol vibe that is just hypnotizing or what's the word intoxicating is the word it's sexy it has great longevity too and the only thing is is discontinued people sell it for like two hundred dollars three hundred dollars it's crazy don't pay that you can just get the juliana uh juliana's perfume version which is scarlet letter and look the liquid is even getting darker so i love it really good i'm so glad that they came out with that because look at this it's getting really dark but i can't keep paying you know, i'm not gonna pay that again i paid like 130 dollars for an ounce okay the next one speaking of vanillas there's a lot of vanillas on here because i'm a vanilla lover okay i am a vanilla lover of all types of vanilla from the most simple to things more uh complicated and spicy um those type of vanillas so this is vanilla 28 have you met her yet if you haven't you need to meet her because this is i don't want to say a basic vanilla but it's just not too complicated but it is beautiful you can layer this to give sweetness to whatever fragrance or you could use it by itself i use it by itself i have used it for layering too um this one um is pretty much full because i had a, a smaller one and then i decided to buy the big bottle but this is beautiful it has that brown sugar vanilla orchid all these beautiful oh, it's so good it's so good okay and then the next what i have is club the nuit intense by armaf and the little thing is broken it doesn't matter okay because this is really 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 good and this is a beast mode this is a banger this is sexy this is daring this is for a statement and it's <laughs> kind of broken but it's good it doesn't matter it's what's inside this is a beautiful oud and rose combo and it's just beautiful the longevity everything and this is said to be very 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 super similar to noir de noir by tom ford um i haven't tried a sample to compare but i've researched and seen so many trustworthy sources say that that you know i'm not gonna try to like figure it out i'm not gonna doubt them okay that's that and this next one i have is vanilla royale this is my other beautiful gold bottle by kayali i love the bottle everything about it this is i fell in love with this when this came out okay i'm gonna read the notes that are on the back just the creme brulee okay brown sugar a little bit of ooh, just a little bit you can barely get it in there the rum the most that i get here is the vanilla the creme brulee and the rum especially in the beginning i get a lot of rum so i'm gonna this stuff is good and patchouli a little bit of patchouli not too much just a little bit of sugar patchouli okay this is a masterpiece i love it love it it reached my top 10 okay the next one i have is you already know that if you've been watching me there was going to be a delina and last time i had delina the original this time i brought her sister delina exclusive she's the older creamier sister and I decided today, this is just how I was feeling today because I really can't choose between them. It's really hard. But today I decided I'm going with the creamier, sexier version, which is the Lina Exclusive, okay? Oh, and uh, if you would like an imitation of that to, uh, for me to give you advice on an imitation, there's so many, so many imitations, uh, dupe houses are, that have done imitation of that, but I have uh, Club de Nuit Imperial. I have it, but I didn't bring it out. That one is really similar and it will give you the vibes if you are not a perfume expert. Even if you are, 
it's still really close so let's not okay now the last one this was the one that i had to there were these two were battling now it's shake should you should i can always say it wrong shake shuyuk by latapa okay Lux edition this one is a i have a little one but um when i run out i want to get a big bottle and blanche b by liquid imagineers they don't want to focus so i was stuck because I love my, this is a beautiful rose and oud with caramel and cinnamon, it's beautiful. But then you have this beautiful creamy deliciousness over here, milky. And I decided, you know what, I need a creamy, I need another cream. I have the Lina in there, but I need another another creamy one in my top scent. So Blanche Bit took the spot, okay? I do have to be in the right mood to wear this because it can get a little bit, how do you say? not cloying because cloying is more like sweet it is a little bit sweet but it's more like milky and very 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 lactonic so you, if you're not in the mood for a very milky lactonic creamy scent you might not wear this but this is a masterpiece okay this is a masterpiece and yeah so it made it to my top 10 that's my top 10 everyone i hope that you like my choices and yeah and if you don't well just get to know me. These are the types. These are my favorite types of fragrances. And yeah, so thanks so much for watching. Until next time.